Okay, so this is for the rectifier and buck converter test. What this test is testing um, is basically if the ripples, um, some noise, even with a really noisy circuit right now, if they would cause any th weird um, outcome on the power. And what we wanted to make sure is that the peak-to-peak -peak or the voltage swing away from the average doesn't bring it outside of a range of operations that we use. Um, so the first test is going to be right off the rectifier. Um, it's basically going into a 12 volt switching regulator. And what we want to make sure of is that um, the swing doesn't bring it below 13 volts. So right now, and this is on 120, um, the 240 case will be actually a lot easier because we can go a lot higher in the voltage and we can go up to 60 volts, which we'll never get to. We'll only go up to maybe about 34. So anyway, so this is, um, what we're worried about is the low side here. So you see we're focused around 17.5 and we have a peak to peak ripple of about four volts on the high side. So if that's too below, that would mean that we're running about 15.5 uh, volts at the very lowest, which is well enough for our switching regulator to supply 12 volts. Um, the next part we're gonna check here is the 12 volt. So let me just get this in here. Um, the 12 volt actually um, there is only used to power this Arduino board here, and the range of operations on the Arduino board is from 6 to 14 with a recommended setting of 8 to 12. And what we see here is we're focused around 11.5 with about a 1.8 volt swing. So if you add the 0.9 in on the top there, we'll actually go a little bit over 12, but it's mainly just switching noise at this time. So it's not going to have any serious effect, especially at 12.1. We're still within the range of operations. And the last thing that we're going to check, if my multimeter doesn't die, is our 5 volt power supply. Um, this one is actually, it's only used for the frequency circuit because the Arduino is powering most of the 5 volt stuff, like this backlight like right here. But what we have here, it's actually, it's saying it's 4.4 volts, so I'm a little bit disappointed at that. But we have a swing of 2.2, uh, but what I've been using is I've actually been powering the frequency circuit off that. And it seems to work okay. The 2.2 volts, it means we're going from about 3.4 to 5.4. And I, the range on the LM is um, 3 to 6 volts, I believe. So I think we're perfectly within range um, on that. So everything's working correctly, and our voltage swings are not impairing our circuit.